I have a lot of people coming up to me saying, I'm so inspired by what you're doing. You're so ambitious. And despite going through such a dark time, you've, you've come up from it and you've turned something that was really awful into something beautiful. I was struggling with the fact that I couldn't control that my mum was dying but I could control my food intake. So it was then that I started to cut little bits out. When the cancer spread again, it was when I just completely declined. When my mum was on her deathbed, my mum said to my dad that she thought I was going to die. I can honestly say the day I was admitted was worse than the day my mum died. It was when I was admitted to hospital I felt like the biggest weight had lifted off my shoulders because I had people around me who knew how to help me. I felt like I kind of bubble wrap around me um, and that's when I started to get better. When my dietitian told me to eat little and often, it was little things, little snacks that actually helped me put the weight back on. I found big meals very, very difficult, but it was little things and that's what made me put the weight on and actually made my head adjust to a better mental state. It's a box full of snacks that are non-clinical for someone who's struggling to eat. Maybe they are going through chemotherapy, Alzheimer's, or like myself, I went through a mental illness. We spend so much time in this room and it's very difficult actually to not eat the food ourselves. Um, sometimes I'm surprised that we've actually got any stock left. We've had people who have said my mum is suffering from Alzheimer's um, and this would be a great gift for her because of her illness she struggles to eat. It's got my story on the back to enforce the fact you're not alone. It's a really difficult time but you're not alone. I went to London the other day. We had a couple of meetings. We decided to barge into big stores and big um, media outlets and say, hi, I'm Emily, this is my story, this is my product, are you interested? And yeah, there were one or two that just looked at me and just thought, they've all gone for lunch, please go. Um, but there were other people that were actually really, really interested. And um, I looked around at all these, at all these really big businesses and I look at them and I just think I want to do that but I want to be better and I want to put my own spin on things. My relationship with my mum, we were best friends. Um, we did everything with each other. I, I told her everything, maybe a little bit too much. I, I miss her so much and with you know the achievements that I've made with the business, I want to ring her straight away and say Oh, mum, I've done this, I've done this, and I can't do that. I think she'd be amazed. Um, but I am a lot like my mum. Um, we're fighters. 